Over in Wakefield, our cameraman has been trundled on a conducted tour of a pit, the like of which you've never seen and won't see anywhere else. Day in, day out, often when the winding wheels of other pits are still, this one keeps on turning. The pit is Peggy Tub May, fantastic one-man mine which never knows lockout or strike trouble. Owner is 41-year-old Bram Pashley, transport driver and ex-miner. If you want to look over Peggy Tub Main, you knock at Mr. Pashley's front door, walk through to the back, and there it is, in the garden. Well below the surface, Bram knew there was a coal seam three foot six inches thick. There wasn't much coal in Mrs. Pashley's cellar at the time, so down Bram went and didn't stop till he hit coal. Three small electric motors, coupled up to the meter in the Pashley's house, drive the winding gear. The air's clear too. The ventilation shaft is run from Mrs. Pashley's vacuum cleaner and the haulage winch used to be the kitchen mangle. On an average Sunday, Bram brings up two tons of best all-purpose coal. Yons the lot for today, he says, and switches off the vacuum cleaner. The one-time mangle, the bicycle crank, pedals and chain come to a stop and the one-man day shift is through. Someday, Bram reckons he'll have a staff of ten men in Peggy Tub May. Meantime, Mrs. Pashley is one of the few women in Britain who's always sure of a full coal house. 